During this unprecedented time, we are constantly finding innovative ways to keep our customers abreast with the latest market update and insights, and most importantly, with your safety in mind. 2020 started out with so much promise and hope that has turned out to be, but has turned out to be crazy and surreal and economically damaging. No economist, investment advisor, and even the feng shui expert would have predicted that the world will be in turmoil because of a virus. By March, Malaysia was in lockdown and this was quickly followed by most countries around the world as the virus spread so fast. Markets went into a tailspin. In Malaysia, we had a double whammy with the sudden collapse of the Pakatan government. The lockdown brought the economy to a standstill, forcing governments around the world to unleash unprecedented fiscal and monetary stimulus and the stock market was one of the biggest beneficiaries. The cash that was unlocked, coupled with more time spent at home, saw retail investors piling into the local stock market. I think the word next six months uh, volatility will be the word uh, because I think in reality markets have done very well on the on the top line basis uh, on the headline uh, on, the, on the headline basis and uh, uh, they were bound to be pullbacks and then we're going to have also event risk uh, in particular the U.S. presidential election and I think I think the key risk to that event is a outcome uh, if the outcome it gets disputed and there will be uncertainty arising from it I think it can be troubling for the marketplace. And you know markets, uh, they don't like uncertainty. Um, and I think that's something to look out for. The only thing safe at the end of the day um, is uh, be, be, be ready to, to, to face volatility. I mean, that, that's the reality that we're going to face, right? And if you are not, there's no such thing as a safe bet in a marketplace. Um, of course, there are things that can give you comfort. Uh, because if you look at the broad market, there are also a lot of value stocks. Uh, whether they're in the banks or in the properties, but they're not going to perform in the short term because they had their own issues to deal with on their earnings. However, in terms of uh, the value that they're trading, it does give you a lot of comfort, uh, in, terms of comfort in terms of margin of safety.